Good morning, y'all. Happy Sunday morning. We're going into the house so Marvin can see all the drywall. What you think, babe? A lot of drywall. What room do you want me to identify? This, this the one with the tub is the bathroom, honey. This is the bathroom. This is the vanity area for my office. And this is just going to be open. It's where the cat boxes will be, in case you wanted to know. This is the office. That's the office closet in there. You just pass the pantry and the guest room. That's where the refrigerator is. Yes. You giving a tour? <clears throat> no, I, I'm identifying the plumbing. This is the back side of the bathroom. The bar room. So we decided what we want to have for dinner this week. We're going to have chicken with stuffing on top, kind of like a casserole. We're going to make taco soup one night and maybe today. And we're going to make baked chicken with potatoes. So I like to cook my chicken with Worcestershire, so and I need some more, so I need to get some. This will work. This is what we got going on here right now. Mr. Hart took care of the poultry and the beef purchase. Crackers or Oreos are on sale. Okay, so we're gonna get us some crackers and Oreos. Making a mess. Hot cocoa dip, what? I don't know about that. <clears throat> it says hot cocoa dip. No. No. No? No. Okay, so let me explain why Marvin is pointing this out. Because the Caesar salad was on sale for three for ten dollars. Yeah. And so I said, hang on. So I said you have to buy three because it says save dollar ninety seven or whatever off of three. And he says, No, you don't. So then he asked the guy and the guy said no and now he's pointing out to clarify for me. So now we all know. Uh, I was right. You were right, honey. I got it on I got it on tape. Didn't make Dr. Pepper anymore, so they have all these other flavors. Why can't they make Dr. Pepper? Because they, there was some kind of agreement that they only could sell in, inside the state and they sold it online out of state so they were forced to keep that up. Okay. <clears throat> and they started bottling the cherry Dr. Pepper. So I just mentioned to Marvin that uh, did he need peanuts and he's like, yes, they're on sale. So now, you was looking for him? Sure, that's fine. What'd you just say? We're gonna be hearing about that all day long. Do you need coffee, honey? No, it's not on sale. So. But do you need coffee? No. Even if it wasn't on sale, you don't need coffee? I would buy it. Yeah, right here with the fruit. Perfect, thank you. What What are you saying, honey? No, that's not what you thought. You didn't have, you had no idea.
I'm making a super easy taco soup for dinner today, we just decided. And we're gonna put avocado as a topping and cheese. Marvin doesn't like sour cream, so I'm not getting that. So, I wanted to check out the avocados. Dude, that's hard. You want like a soft one, but not one this squishy. Good Lord, these are not ripe at all. Hmm. They don't appear to be ripe, so maybe passing on the avocado. Be really hard avocado. Not even close. Good. When you're buying eggs, she should always open the container and check it to make sure none of them are cracked. Yeah, see? See that one's messed up in there. What did you just say? You must buy one at least. Why are you saying that? Because it says two for six. You're still making fun of me. Not really, I was but, just exclaiming that the sign says two for six. You must buy one for three dollars. Oh my gosh. You think you got jokes. Marvin and I are going to take a quick load over to the storage unit and put away the microwave and some more kitchen stuff. Oh, and he needs a jacket. So here we go. We're an adventure. We're moving. Not yet, we're just moving stuff. We're not moving just yet. Well. But you lied to me, man. I thought we were moving. Not today. When? Soon. The end of March. The Ides of March. I don't know when the, when is the Ides of March. I don't know. I'd have to look it up. 5th of March. 5th of March. Okay, well, there you have it. <laughs> so. All right. This is useless information. Yes, that you can store up in your brain for next time you're on Jeopardy or something like that. You'll be ready. Dude, that house does look bad. Mm. It's the burnt out house. I don't know why, like it takes, there was a house that burnt down on the corner several years back and it took them a long time to get that house done too, right? Yeah, squabbling with the insurance company, things like that. Like that. So, hadn't really talked to that family in a while, so we're actually since they're not a fire, but hopefully they had enough insurance and such to get them through that. But today was a pretty day. Um, I boxed up some more stuff in the kitchen, like mixer and like our smoothie maker thing and all that kind of stuff. So um, don't anticipate really using it in the next couple months. And so I thought I'd better box it up take it up to the storage unit. Then I'm gonna have Mr. Hard determine how much more we can fit in. He'll probably say a lot more, but you know, he, that's that's his area. That's not my area. I'm just hauling stuff over there. He'll probably rearrange it all too. Who knows? And then we're gonna make taco soup for dinner, or I'm gonna make it for dinner. And I'll show you the recipe. It's like super easy. It's mostly just browning some ground beef, adding some cans of stuff, calling it a day. Taco soup, start by browning the hamburger one pound with about half of an onion. I added some salt and pepper, a little bit of garlic powder. You're gonna drain the grease off of the beef and then add a can of pinto beans or you can use kidney beans, a can of corn, eight ounce can of tomato sauce, can of diced tomatoes, and a can of black beans. And you're also going to add a packet of this original taco seasoning mix. Add all the cans, but don't forget, don't drain them. And add the taco seasoning. And then mix it really well. 
and let it simmer for about 10, 15 minutes so all the flavors will blend. Okay, so here's how the taco soup turned out. Now I'm gonna add some, I'm using monster cheese because that's my favorite. Sprinkling some cheese on. And then I'm gonna top it with some of these Southwest flavor tortilla strips. You can find that in the salad dressing aisle, I think. Wasn't the salad dressing aisle, honey? Huh? Salad dressing aisle? Where we found this? Like by the croutons, I think? Yeah. Um, there we go. I'm gonna go to bed early because I have a full week. But I'm just gonna show you guys the bedroom because I've cleared almost all of it out. And I feel like I need to show you. So basically, the room is empty, and except for the desk, this desk, my dad made that out of a pallet, and those four boxes back there are full of packing paper, so we're hanging on to those until we're going to pack up the rest of the house once we sell it. This, I'm probably selling, it's just like a little nightstand, end table type thing, and this needs to go to the storage unit and then the only other thing i have is some boards that i used for backdrops when i took photos and there's a few things in the closet but it's like stuff like our i don't know like current paperwork stuff you know um monthly bills just some files about the house so i'm keeping those we are probably replacing that chandelier with a ceiling fan so we looked at those the other day um i still have up on top there oh the places will go and then i had my map under it but i'd already took the map down i took down the um, cork board that i had here so oh and there is a there is a shelf right there so that shelf needs to go too but um really everything's pretty much cleared out in the other bedroom, I have, I can show you that real quick too. Oh, there's the cat. So in the other bedroom, everything is almost all cleared out. Got this shelf, that's what we store all of our surplus stuff, like extra shampoo, extra soap and stuff like that. Um, and this stuff down here is donation stuff, or at least most of it is. So that's gonna be gone in the next week. So, progress was made. So anyway, I'm going to end the vlog here. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm going to get caught up on editing really quick before I go to bed. And I will see you tomorrow. Bye. Thank you.